Good afternoon, 47. Your destination is the annual Global Innovation Motor Race in Miami, Florida. After analyzing the data from Reynard's computer, the case is clear. The Providence defectors are Robert and Sierra Knox, head of robotics developer Kronstadt Industries. A visionary inventor and technological innovator, Robert Knox has spearheaded Kronstadt Industries to the bleeding edge of technological development. His equally brilliant daughter, Sierra, is not only a financial wizard, but also a fiercely competitive race car driver with a fiery temper to match. Hey, hey, hey. Kronstadt enjoys enormous popularity with global consumers. However, few are aware that the company is robots. also one of the world's leading suppliers of next-gen military tech. Makes sense. Big Last money year, moment. Despotic ruler Jin Po employed prototype Kronstadt drones against peaceful civilian protesters in the now infamous Tung Yen Bay uh, incident. Shit. And although it has yet to be proven, there is little doubt that the Noxes personally brokered the deal, making them complicit in a war crime. It is unclear why the Noxes would betray their masters, but likely the fear of being next on the Shadow Client's hit list has pressured them to cut a deal with the enemy. Undoubtedly, with Kronstadt Industries on their side, the militia will increase their attacks tenfold. And so our contract obligates us to retire Robert and Sierra Knox and contain the damage they may inflict on Providence. I will okay. leave you to prepare. All right. So, Jin here, welcome back to Hitman. Um, so, today we are going to be doing this. All right. Let's get it. Oh, yeah, he's got some burn marks, bro. Oh, should good. Should be good for a little minute. Welcome to Miami, forty-seven. Oh yeah. The innovation race is on its last day, and it is down to the wire. Thousands of eager fans are gathered for the final laps of this unexpectedly close race. Sierra Knox is expertly piloting her red Kronstadt car. Her father, Robert Knox, roams the nearby Expo building where Kronstadt is showcasing its new prototype car. The Kronstadt RK Mark III has seen fierce competition from the Chinese Kowoon Heavy Industries' new racer. Moses Lee, CEO of Kowoon, has taken a dominant lead and looks invincible. Sierra Knox will need to risk it all if she wants to win for the third year in a row. Damn. The stakes are as high as they can get. So, my, so if she's going to be racing the entire time, I'm guessing my best bet is to screw with her during a pit stop. Alright, let's get it. Look at this flamingo man. Damn! This guy! Yo! I hope I don't have a gun on me. This is just standard procedure. Don't worry, folks. Anything can still happen. Good. You're clean and good to go. Literally have no items. Where'd the flamingo man go? Alright, so where is our targets? Okay, I'm guessing that's Knox. Don't know where the woman is. So I guess we'll figure it out. All right. So that's See that red car, 47? That's no. the Kronstadt race car what? with Sierra Where? Knox behind the wheel. What? What? Oh, that one. Okay. Damn. Can I? Can I run out there and get hit by a car? That'd be funny. Alright. Let's follow this guy. Alright. Oh, well, there she goes. Let's follow this guy. And take him out in secret. Get him. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. 
now let's, let's pick up this key card and let's drag him into this. Okay, no one knows at all. Alright, now we're gonna grab his disguise. We now work for them. Blue is parking, so maybe that's where the car will be. There we go. Ooh! Ah, Flamingo Man. I'm here now. Ready to meet up with Sierra Knox over at the hotel. Yeah, after the race. I've just got to pick up the documents from my van, but um, I had to knock out a guy and steal his flamingo outfit, and now I can't find my car keys. Yeah, I know it's dumb. I think I lost him in the scuffle, but the real mascot is still over there. If I don't get them, I've got no evidence. Bye-bye money. I don't know. I, I, I need to figure something out. Talk soon. Blood proof. Hey yo, bring them back to you, my guy. Hey, yo, did you find some keys over there? Oh, yo, I can actually give it to him. Awesome. Oh, man, you're a real lifesaver. Thank you. I got you, bro. Yo, look at this. This guy is like, um, that, that robot from Star Wars. No one's gonna see it. Go. And that's why we have a crowbar, so we can break in to places. But yeah, I'm just the Nox's mechanic. Oh, look at that, a brand new crowbar. We've got two crowbars, because we're just that epic. You could probably get up here and throw something down on the tracks, which can cause a crash. That would have probably been cool if I known that. Alright. I like how our barcode just perfectly see through the cap. Like, that's not suspicious. Alright. Any reports you may be in possession of are likely to be fakes crafted by our competitors. Well, I'm, I'm sure your father would be very interested in reports concluding that some Huh? Oh. You're a cannibal for this mess? Fucking look at me. Watch out, sir. Hey, what the hell's wrong with you? Kill up another one or a bigger. Kill him. He's hit. I didn't want to kill you, Flamingo Man. I liked you very much. But you've seen too much, buddy. There we go. Ain't nobody gonna know. We're on the same level as the man, so this should be easy. Okay, we're now trespassing. So let's overflow this sink. And grab this screwdriver and grab this rat poison. Run over here. Uh, grab our drink again, once again. Oh. That's not who we wanted to investigate. The reason we didn't want him to investigate is because he's one of the people that we can't dress up as because he's already compromised. Not good, 
not good, not good. Hey, we're not compromised. My dad served this country. Sorry. Private security grinds my gears a little. Hello, HR? Yes, it's Ben Wheeler down at the other side of the Okay, McKinnis, let's run this test. You're sure you fixed all outstanding That issues. is Robert Knox. Genius inventor, black market's weapons dealer, and Providence defector. Uh-huh. Hmm, hang on, 47. Robert Knox's calendar shows a meeting with a Ted Mendez, a defense funding consultant with the U.S. military. It must be related to that robot. Maybe you can find Mendez somewhere. This is a pivotal moment in modern conflict. This is gonna be easy. He's just come out here all on his own. Target dealt with. Both targets down. Well done, 47. Head for an exit, and we'll speak again soon. So there's a camera on the other side of this wall, but I think it can see me. Okay, well it can't, but it's acting like it can. Yo, nice. Oh, a dingery do. I can beat someone with a dingery do. Are you insane? Someone, please help me. I need help here. How could you kill someone throwing shit around like that? Don't help! Me! Whoa! Why would you? Ha 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 ha! Awesome way to extract. Berlin. Shanghai. Montreal. We're bleeding operatives. Panic is spreading, and now we are axing our own. Knox was a traitor. He would have caused incalculable damage. And he won't be the last. This is exactly what the enemy wants. We need to fight the sickness, not the symptom. And I have just the tool for the job. Yo, we right. are getting kind of epic. The Burnwood woman. Eric Soders warned you about her, didn't he? The Crusader. I can handle this Burnwood. Everyone hates power until you offer them some. ICA speaks the enemy's language. We need them. And once we don't, <laughs> we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Fact remains, we are shadow boxing. We need to know who we are up against. I was getting to that. His name is Lucas Gray, the late Mr. Cobb's head of security. Oh, Cobb shit. was ground zero. First of our operatives to die. It had to be one of his staff, someone with military training and access to the plane. Yeah, grasping at straws. Ray is a mercenary, a veteran of every backwater tragedy you've ever ignored on the five o'clock news. Oh. Chechnya, Sierra Leone, the list goes on, but before 89, nothing. No records of any kind. Oh, come on. CIA, KGB, plenty of spies went dark. After the curtain was lifted, I cast a very wide net. Lucas Gray simply does not exist. Oh, 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 oh. Mm. If you're all quite done wetting yourselves with excitement, I couldn't give two shits where he came from. <laughs> That's a good, that's a good one. How does he know about us?
Central Europe. I swear to God. This hearts and flowers crap will get us both killed. Can't you see? Your so-called friend is working for them now. He's not the man you knew. This is his fight too, Olivia. Even if he doesn't realize it. Like it or not, 47 is our last and only lead on the partners. He needs to remember. He's coming for us. And unlike you, he won't hesitate. Whoa. That's a little bit of a... A little Rico, bit of a back hit. I need a favor. Yo. Are we in Russia? Yo, that's Russian text. I don't think it actually was. I think I just saw like two letters and I thought that was Russian text. I'm probably wrong. Okay. So if you just did, leave a like if you liked it, subscribe if you want to, and leave a comment down below saying if you want to see any more Hitman or any games that you have uh, suggestions for, leave them in the comments as well. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.